This is CBS 8 News Live at Noon. Good afternoon. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Heather Myers and I'm Evan Irani in for Netta Iranpour. Right now, a judge is getting ready to decide whether a sexually violent predator should be placed in a home in Borrego Springs. As you can imagine, residents are not happy about this idea and they are making their voices heard. CBS 8's Ariana Cohen has some of the concerns that are being brought up today. Yes, parents express their concerns to the judge that they do not want this sexually violent predator living in their neighborhood. They just took a short break in the courtroom and they just got back in and the, the judge said he will not be making a decision today. Now, 79 year old Douglas Badger is classified as a sexually violent predator. He was proposed to be placed at a Borrego Springs home after placements in Mount Helix and in Rancho Bernardo fell through last year after strong pushback from the community. Community. Under the proposal, Badger would live under supervision at 1619 Zuni Trail. This is near Borrego Springs. Badger has served five separate prison terms for several different convictions, which include child molestation and kidnapping, according to the district attorney's office. Most of his victims were boys and strangers to him. Many residents in the community say Badger does not belong in the neighborhood. People living in Borrego Springs say 19 children live in the area. This this morning, sexual abuse survivors, state representatives, people living in Borrego Springs, and a mother spoke out expressing her concerns. I have three children. I am terrified. It's a mother's worst nightmare to know that you're being put in a situation where you're unable to protect your children. Again, the judge said no decision will be made today. The judge also said he walked around the area himself, yet they still want to investigate the, the location where Badger would be located. The judge also said Badger would be monitored with a GPS and supervised.